Welcome back, everyone. We're out here with Kimberly Rohde, right, from yeah. the Flint Children's Museum. And Joel's out here, too, because he's going to have to uh, lend a hand in just a couple of minutes because we're going to have to do some running. Now, we were out here earlier, and we were able to show everybody how these little paint things explode. And it's a great way for kids to get out and have some fun during the summer. Absolutely. It is a great summertime activity for the kids. Just take the paint, add a little water, add an Alka-Seltzer, put the top on, turn it upside down on your paper, and step back. Excellent. Okay, now we want to show too that these are washable paints, right? Yes. So don't worry, mom, dad, you're not going to get paint everywhere that you can't get rid of. Also, same thing with clothes, I'm assuming. Yes. Yep. Okay, yeah, perfect. Right. Yes. Okay, washable paint. But just because it's washable doesn't mean you don't want these. So Absolutely. let's make sure we've got our safety glasses on. I got no safety glasses. You're going to be standing out of the way. It's going to be <laughs> That's fine. All right. That's all right. Okay, now what we're going to be doing again is putting the Elka Seltzer in, putting the caps on. Mm -hmm running over here, putting them upside down, and then we get to sit back. There will be a slight delay, and these things are going to pop. Exactly. Excellent. Perfect. Okay, so let's get ready to do that. Joel, I'm going to hand this over to you, and All here right. we go. And these look like little film canisters. Is that what they are, Kimberly? Yeah, because yeah, yeah. if you don't have the, the little thing, you know, you... You can't do it. And, uh, again, it, it could go right all over your head. So I'm going to be clear. And she's shaking them up. This is basically Alka-Seltzer and paint and water. And uh, what's going to happen here, Ahmed? Now, these things are going to pop in, a, well, in a, just a few seconds. We saw a bunch of them earlier. Now, the one is leaking a little bit, but we had a delayed one earlier as well. So let's keep an eye Whoa, on this. There's, there's one. one. There's one. <laughs> I can see a couple of them. They're starting <laughs> right. to bubble a little bit. Here we go. Will they come our way is my question. You never know. <laughs> <laughs> um, now, what, now, would you recommend them doing this, obviously, in like an open space, probably away from their backyard? Absolutely. Okay. In the backyard, away from the house, away from any pets and things like that. And like you said, have mm -hmm. the goggles on, have paint clothes on. Um, yeah, and the whole point of it is to get creative with the children, depending on what their um, <laughs> developmental level is. If you want to talk to them about the science of the chemical reaction that the um, sodium bicarbonate is having, having with the water, or you can look at it from an artistic oh. <laughs> um, perspective and talk to them about abstract art and Jackson Pollock. Excellent. Or yeah. Excellent. Thank you very much. All right, we've been out here with the Flint Children's Museum having a little bit of fun. Liz, we're going to be sending it right back into you. All right. Looks like a lot of fun out there, you guys. <laughs> 